Hey, how's it going? So, we're going to check out the second half of that Christmas Don't Be Late. Um, we're, if, if you got to go through the first video to review the first part, go ahead and do that. Um, the second video is strictly on the second part. So, we're taking it right after that um, because you repeat it, right? You play the first part, then you repeat the first part, and then you end up on this... You end up there. So what we're going to do is we're going to take that. Right? And then now we're going to add the, uh, the modulation to it. So what that is, is I'm taking this shape here, which is a G shape, but I'm moving it up one fret. And I'm putting my first finger on the top string. So first finger, fourth string, first fret. Second finger is going to be on the, the third string on the third fret. Third finger is on the third fret of the first string, and your pinky is going to be on the fourth fret of the second string. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to move this shape now. We're going to go hit that, then this finger comes off. We're going to slide the whole thing back one fret, go back to the first shape, then we're going to move up a fret, up a fret, up a fret, and then up a fret. Okay, so it's like. Okay, so dun, 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 dun. okay, and now we're changing it to the key of C. So it's it's gonna be the same melody line, and we're just gonna kind of play it in an easier key now. The the thing you're gonna notice about this is is not as much picking. There's a lot more strumming with this part. So we're gonna go. We're picking the first part. Okay, we're picking those three strings: the four, three, and two. Open, yeah. Then we're hitting that. Then we single that note right there, right? The second string, third fret. So we have. So pick, pick, strum, open. Okay. And then we hit that third, third fret of the first string. Just one pick, yeah. Then we strum that on the. The C major 7, which is our second finger on the second fret of the first string. So we have. And then we end up with an open strum. Okay, so. And then we hit that again, the C major 7, strum it. Hit that note again, right? And now we're going to play this chord here. So first finger, third fret, second string. Second finger is going to be on the fourth fret of the fourth string. And then third finger is going to be on the fifth, fifth fret of the third string. And we're going to strum it open. Okay, so we got... And then we'll go to the G7 chord which everybody should know by now, but we go for it anyway. So first finger, second fret, or second string, first fret, second finger, second fret, third string, and third finger, second fret of the first string. So, so we have that G7 chord right there, so. hit this G7 and then our pinky is going to come up and catch the third fret and we're just just playing that note so even though I'm still holding the chord don't get confused it's just going to be just that note right and then we're going to hit these three strings while holding the G7 right the fourth third and second so all together That's the first part, and in the second half, we're going to hit this D minor, we're going to strum, then open, yeah, and then G7, and then pinky goes to the fifth fret of the first string, and then we're going to go back to that D, D minor 7 chord, so, then open A, G7, 
Then the first one again. Open G7. Pinky again at the fifth fret. And then we're going to hit the C. So C and then open. Okay, so what we have is. That's where we're at now. So now we're going to start again, and this is kind of like the first part where we pick those three. Right? So we got the, the three, the third fret of the second string, and then strum. And then we pick the C, right? And then strum the C major seven. Back to that note, right? Back to the uh, D. Or I'm sorry. What is this a G? Back to the G. So we're so we got that right. Okay. So now we're gonna go ahead and put these fingers in the cascading order from the fifth fret, right? Fifth fret, fourth fret, sec, uh, third fret, and it's on the fourth string, third string, and second string. So we got that, and we're gonna pick the open A. So we pick those consecutively. If you, if you can't pick it like this, then just strum it. Stop your thumb there. Yeah? So. so we got that. Those three and then the open A. Then we put this finger, we're holding this chord, and we're going to drop this finger down so it's flat. So this is a C chord. Um, but now your first finger is holding two strings at the third fret. Yeah? Okay, so... And then we're going to hit that 7th fret with our pinky of the 1st string and just hit that by itself. Okay, so. Then we're going to do this chord here where we're barring this, um, the 5th fret with our 1st finger. And we're going to put our ring finger at the 7th fret of the 2nd string. So we got... We're gonna take off the ring finger. So and then just play that open and strum. So we got Okay. So now we're gonna hit this chord here where we're barring the seventh fret. We've got our second finger on the eighth fret of the second string and our third finger on the ninth fret of the third string. And we're gonna we're gonna pick all of these in that order, like so, from top to bottom. Yeah? And then we're gonna use our pinky on the tenth fret of the second string. So, and then that diminished chord that we did in the first video, we're gonna do it here at the seventh fret. So it's gonna be these two fingers in the seventh fret on the second and fourth string, and then these two fingers are gonna be on the eighth fret at the first and third string. So what we have is like, and then we're going to bring this down, hit that string, the first string at the seventh fret, the seventh fret. And we're going to bar the fifth fret and strum it open. And hit our pinky on the eighth fret of the second string. And then we're going to go back to the chord that we did down here in the first video, but we're doing it here at the uh, seventh fret. So what that is, is 7th fret, 6th fret, 8th fret, and 7th fret. And it's all going 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay? And then we hit this note of, after we do that. So 2nd string. Okay? And then we go to this chord. So I'm holding down these three on the 5th fret. And that's the 4th, 3rd, and 2nd. Then the, the C at the third fret of the first string. And then G7 again. And then the fifth, fifth fret of the first string. And then we do that C chord that we learned earlier. But now we're going to do something different. We're going to go. Then we're going to bar this 
the whole thing at the third fret and keep that finger there, but we're taking off our ring finger. So it turns it from C to C7, yeah? Then we repeat that last part again. And when we hit this last note, we're gonna go. That first part that we did in the first video, we're moving it up to the fifth fret. Okay, so we're gonna hit that fifth fret of the fourth string, slide from seven to nine. Right, so seven, nine, and pull off to seven. Yeah? Then we're gonna hit 10 on the first string. Then we're gonna hit the ninth fret of the fourth string and slide down to the seventh. Yeah? And we do that four times. Then we hit the C major seven chord and we do uh, a tremolo strum. So it's like. And that's Christmas Don't Be Late. Is the tremolo strum a little bit? Like, All like you do, yeah. you take your finger and you go really fast. That's it. You can use any finger. You can use, I've seen guys use their thumbs. I can't do it with my thumb. Um, you get those really weird, strange guys that'll do it with their. That's for Andrew right there. <laughs> but yeah, this is this is a Christmas song, guys, and like, hopefully you have enough time to learn it before Christmas. Um, we have this video up on on our on our site, and it's also on the YouTube site too. So, uh, well, what we'd like for you guys to do is send videos of you playing this song and, and link it up as like a response or something because we'd like to see that we'll pick out the best one and we'll throw it on our site so you guys can you guys can like you know check it out have fun with it and this is just going to be fantastic to just try to play along but remember christmas is coming so learn it fast aloha